<laughs> and now it's a pleasure to welcome a dear girl, the very lovely Leanne Best. She will announce the finalists and winners of the Impact Award of Improving Community Cohesion. And hi, Leanne, how are you? <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Athna, looking good, as per usual. Um, it's such a pleasure and an honour to be here with you tonight to present this award. I wish we could all be doing it together in the same room, but soon, soon we will. And um, I think there's no uh, there's no better place that we could be celebrating when it comes to true grit and community getting us through a bit of a bit of a rough time. So, mwah, love you all. You're all gorgeous. Now. <sighs> This award is to celebrate the power and value of culture and creativity to achieve positive outcomes in community cohesion. About that, the finalists are Liverpool Irish Centre is the home of Irish culture on Merseyside, keeping Irish dance, music, and song alive for the generations and has taken this rich heritage to write, produce and perform an annual pantomime which adapts traditional tales and makes them uniquely Irish yet totally inclusive and very funny. The Wirral Multicultural Organisation is a registered charity that offers a range of professional and culturally sensitive services to improve the overall health and the well-being of the local BAME communities. The LCR Pride Foundation champions LGBT plus rights in the city region. During the pandemic, the foundation worked with its partners and sponsors to agree on a financial plan to support their £20,000 community fund initiative. And now back to hear the winners from Leanne Best. The winner of this category is a community hub that serves lots of different and diverse communities, not just for Irish people, but others including Tamil, Indian, Polish, Kerala, Filipino, Nigerian, Nepalese and East Timorese. It is a place for people to celebrate their culture, to forge great friendships and to celebrate their heritage. They work hard identifying the importance of art and culture in their cohesive community through delivering intergenerational projects. During 2020, their volunteers have been transforming the centre's garden, creating a little oasis on West Derby Road. I am absolutely delighted to announce that the winner is... What's the most exciting thing the top dog here? Liverpool Irish Centre. <laughs> oh, Leanne, so wonderful to see you. Thank you so much. And congratulations also to the Wirral Multicultural Organisation and to the LCR Pride Foundation. Please, please, please keep up the good work. But congratulations to the Liverpool Irish Centre. Thank you for dressing Thank up. You, you look so beautiful. Much. Well, I had to dress up, but we did our pantomime last year yeah. and it was um, Robin Hood and his Kerry men, so came with a bit of a maid Marion. <laughs> The Kerry men. Right. So we are absolutely delighted. There has been so much work that goes into all the projects that go on at the Irish Centre, but the pantomime, especially musicians volunteer, all the actors volunteer their time, and Patrick Gall, who writes them himself, everyone is just so dedicated to making the place just so welcoming to anyone that wants to come along. <laughs> Thank you so much, and Thank Ziggy, you. my dog, is delighted as well. <laughs> I can hear your dog is absolutely thrilled for you. <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> oh, listen. <laughs> of course he does. Anyway, so <laughs> congratulations, and carry on enjoying. Thank you so much. Every so you do for the region. Get the dog off. I will do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now, ladies and gentlemen, we have a very special performance for you. It is 